Okay, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can make rust ink. Um, I don't have it right now, but once I make the other video, this is just part one. I'm going to use glue, clear glue, and some coloring ink, like school coloring ink. And once I do the process, I have the iron oxide. And I'll be able to do the iron oxide ink. Um, this is good if you're going to want to make some kind of um, magnetic ink. So basically you look for some kind of metal, uh, iron. I still got these leftovers of iron filings. So I'm going to grab some of it and just drop it in there. I don't want a lot, but so that's vinegar, white distilled vinegar, the white one. Don't use apple cedar because it'll change the coloring on it. Okay, now you put table salt. Do not use sea salt. And I'm missing something. Hold up a second. Yeah, I was missing one of the main ingredients. It's hydrogen peroxide. And this is 35% food grade. It's already starting to react. Look, the colors. Changing color already. Turn into a grayish. So now I'm going to add the hydrogen peroxide. And look at that. See how fast it just turned red? start rusting immediately and I believe this is the fastest way you'll ever be able to do it so this is just the first video I'm gonna make but this is the way to go if you're gonna make hydrogen um, if you're gonna make magnetic ink it's basically iron oxide that's where to go is hydrogen peroxide 35% white distilled vinegar, table salt, and you will get this reaction immediately. It's even heating up already, so. See how fast? This is the fastest way, I believe. So, if you like this video, press like, subscribe to my channel. This is Luis Martinez in Baytown, Texas.